in the upcoming reveal of Road to GH, after the mysterious gun is sent to the PCPD headquarters, many questions arise about its origins and who was behind the delivery. The vague clues lead people to speculate that Sonny was behind this move in an effort to protect Alexis from prosecution. However, this action comes with many risks, as instead of resolving the issue, it could redirect the police investigation back towards Sonny himself. With many enemies lurking in the shadows and unresolved conflicts, Sonny's decision seems to be pushing him into a dangerous dead end. Initial suspicions all point towards Sonny, Molly, or Sam when the mysterious gun appears at the PCPD. However, upon closer inspection, both Molly and Sam lack the reason or courage to carry out such a bold action. Gradually, it becomes clear that only one person could be behind this scheme. Brennan. He's the only one with both the motive and audacity to interfere with the investigation, not just to free Alexis, but also to take control of the situation for himself. By doing so, Brennan has quietly turned the tables, not only gaining an advantage for himself, but also shifting all suspicion away from him. Brennan's true motive is cleverly hidden behind a facade of kindness and helpfulness. Outwardly, he seems like a loyal friend, always showing up at the right time to assist Alexis, making many believe he genuinely wants to protect her from the police investigation. However, behind those actions lies a sophisticated plot to take down Sonny, a man Brennan has always viewed as a formidable rival in the underworld. Sending the mysterious gun to the PCPD was, in fact, part of a larger plan. Brennan knew that if the police received the gun, all eyes would turn to Sonny. In a world where trust is fragile and danger lurks around every corner, drawing police attention to Sonny would isolate him, forcing him to defend himself and weakening his power. Furthermore, Sonny would be imprisoned. Known for his ability to control situations, Sonny now finds himself facing a relentless investigation, putting him in a vulnerable position. But Brennan doesn't stop there. He knows the best way to destroy someone as powerful as Sonny is not through a direct confrontation, but by breaking him from the inside. That's why Brennan deliberately approaches Carly, Sonny's ex-wife, with whom he still harbors deep feelings. Brennan understands that Carly is one of Sonny's biggest weaknesses, and by getting close to her, he can create a deep rift between the two. Naturally, Carly becomes furious when she realizes the truth about Brennan. She trusted him, thinking that he genuinely cared and wanted to help, but it turns out it was all part of a complex scheme to take down Sonny. Carly feels betrayed, not just because Brennan exploited their relationship, but because he put her in extreme danger. In her anger, Carly gradually understands that Brennan not only broke her trust, but also placed her at legal risk, as she had lied to the police to protect Sonny. In an emotional moment, Carly must face the consequences of her past decisions. Providing false testimony at the police station could lead to a deeper investigation. And if the truth about her false statements is uncovered, Carly will not only face a loss of honor, but also the possibility of being charged. She can't believe that Brennan, someone she had started to open up to, would heartlessly use her to execute his scheme against Sonny. Carly's situation becomes more perilous than ever. If the truth comes out, the police won't just focus on Sonny, but may begin to investigate Carly's involvement in the case. Her false testimony could make Carly an accomplice, pulling her deeper into the legal trap Brennan had quietly set up. She realizes that she can't escape this easily. Once the truth about the mysterious gun is revealed, Carly has no choice but to flee abroad with her daughter. She knows that if she stays, her false testimony at the police station will result in her facing jail time. Carly feels angry and bitter about being used by Brennan, but she also realizes that Sonny's warning about this risk had been right from the start. Now, to protect herself and her daughter, she must escape and start a new life in a foreign land, even though she knows the journey ahead will be full of challenges. Meanwhile, Sonny must face both Brennan and the police, who are focusing their investigation on the case. Brennan is a cunning and dangerous enemy, and Sonny understands that he is gradually destroying his life and power. To survive and protect everything that matters, Sonny must devise a clever plan, leveraging his relationships and loyal allies. He can't attack Brennan directly, but must dismantle his schemes piece by piece by exposing Brennan's weaknesses. 
Sonny knows that this battle is not only to protect himself, but also to ensure the safety of Carly and his daughter. Although their relationship has gone through many difficulties, Sonny still feels responsible for protecting the mother of his child. He secretly contacts people who can help Carly stay safe abroad while preparing for a confrontation with Brennan. The battle with Brennan won't be easy, but Sonny is determined to turn the tide. He must use all his intelligence and experience to defeat a dangerous enemy, protect his family, and maintain the power he has built over the years. Brennan's move was bold and cunning. He carefully calculated to not only attack Sonny through the police, but also exploit Carly, creating a deep rift in Sonny's personal life. Brennan knew that by pushing Carly into a difficult position, he could make Sonny lose what mattered most and put him in danger from multiple angles. However, Sonny is not someone easily defeated. With many years of experience in the underworld and the support of loyal allies, Sonny is sure to strike back at Brennan decisively. He will not only face off with his enemy legally, but also use his network to unravel Brennan's plot. Sonny's intelligence and tactical skills will help him identify Brennan's weaknesses and turn the situation around. Sonny can use both psychological strength and skillful relationship building to gradually weaken Brennan. This battle is not just about direct confrontation, it's also a mental war, where whoever can control the situation better will emerge victorious. So how will Sonny fight? Will Brennan truly have the upper hand, or will Sonny strike back and regain everything? Stay tuned for the dramatic next chapters of this story. Thank you.